Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's Tony Bennett. Nothing like professional show business. Okay, here we go. We're all ready to roll now. My name is Steve Martin. I'll be out here in just a moment, and we'll be ready to roll. I'm just a professional act in show business. I try to do a professional show where I am, especially on television. So what you're seeing is completely print, planned out, and rehearsed. And I'm... Here we go. So here we go. Here we go. We're ready now. Here we go. Let's go. <laughs> So here we go, professional acting show business. How do you do? I'm so glad you could come by. Yeah. Um, do a lot of comedy, and I mean the funny stuff. So let's get into the really funny comedy that I do. Here we go. Thank you. It's a funny bit. <laughs> it's a cheap laugh. It's 39 cents, but okay. Here we go. We're, gonna, we're rolling now, huh? By the way, I write a lot of songs for the banjo, and uh, I'm happy to say that one of the big groups now, Crosby, Stills, Nash and, Na <laughs> Crosby, Stills, Nash and Young, are back together, and uh, they are going to record a couple of my tunes on their next album, so I'm pretty excited. And if any of you write songs, you know how hard it is to get material to a big group like that, but I happen to be a personal friend of one of the guys in the group, so that's how I... I'm friends with uh, Crosby Stills. So it's all. <laughs> all right, here we go. Is this a group? Can you hear me all right? Is this Mike? Can you hear me out there? Is this Mike out? Is this Mike out okay? <laughs> okay. How about a little dueling banjos? People like your dueling banjos. Now, very, first of all, it's very difficult to play it with just one instrument. But I've taken this into consideration. I knew people would want to hear dueling banjos, so I worked up a special arrangement of dueling banjos for one banjo. I think this is really going to knock out. So here we go, dueling banjos. not plugged in, but... Okay, let's get moving. Here we go. Oh, gosh, I just remember I had this on. <laughs> it's so stupid. 
wear to wear something like this in front of all these people, I, I feel imbecilic. I mean, that is really dumb. I will never ever wear something like this again. <laughs> And now I realize a lot of you people are sitting out there saying to yourself, sure he's great. But can he do balloon animals? <laughs> I feel great. Well, let me warn you kids, stay away from it. To the harder stuff. Inner tubes and blimps. <laughs> See how I fill the blooms up with words, and if they pop, they go. I hope nobody walks in right now, you know? <laughs> oh, look, a female impersonator. Oh. <laughs> All right, and now it's time for fun balloon animals. Here we go. show you how this works. Whoa. See, if you wear this on your head, then no one will talk to you. Oh, gosh. Stay. So I guess I'll say goodnight now. And, you know, now I don't want to sound a cornball or anything like that. But I've gone everywhere and I've done everything. I've seen everything there is to see. I've been to Marseille in the Isle of Dupre. I've climbed Mount Mithnoui. I bought hot dogs in France and I've painted a fence. Played marbles for hours on end. I've rolled jelly beans up an incline. I put an umbrella in my mouth and opened it. I sat on a lemon meringue pie. I've done terrible things to my dog with a fork. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on, hurry up. Come on. Come on. Hurry up. Come on. Maxwell, come here. Come on. Okay. That's a good one. <laughs> well, he wants it again. What do you know? Okay. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, I'll just... <laughs> well, Maxwell, it's you and me. Let's go, boy. 